Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Conan Exiles. I've come to a realization. I hate this axe. I hate it. I hate it so much. Today, we're going to continue to explore this a little. Oh, you got to be kidding me. What is this? Signs? Um. Hmm. We're going to continue to explore this, uh, this new addition to Conan Exiles, but probably not stay in here too long. In the last episode, we left off somewhere around there, and I got wrecked. <laughs> um, I hate this hammer. What does this say? Exclamation point. Clomp Avengers were here. Are we not merciful? What? 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 Huh? You know, I've seen some comments like, Oh, why don't you guys cool it with the whole club thing and rivalry? It's really, it's getting really stale. It's really forced. I can assure you it's not forced on my part. I honestly have nothing to do with this stuff. Why is this hammer so bad at things? Um, uh, but yeah, I, I don't know. I just, wo I, I woke up and this guy is like right in front of me here. And I bet he's in here. Is he in here? Huh. Can I break this? I don't know if I can. Am I doing damage to it? I feel like I'm doing damage here. I'm going to sit here and do this for a little while. Uh, uh, this guy's... This guy's base must be made out of ridiculously strong stone. And this door must be made out of impervious wood. Because I cannot get in there. I don't even know if he's in there, to be honest with you. Okay, never mind, never mind. I'm out of here. I don't like this stupid clop guy anyway. Um, I don't need I don't need to break in. I'm a gentleman. I don't need to I don't need to take you down when you're asleep. You're gonna pay for uh, the frustrations I've been having. You know what I'm gonna do, guys? When I get back to my place, I'm gonna make the, the long sword. You know, I want a two-handed weapon. I feel like this guy here does well does well with two-handed weapons. He just looks like a two-handed weapon kind of guy. Um But this hammer, this hammer is just not doing it for me, so forget the hammer. I'm done with the hammer. We're going with a two-handed sword as soon as I explore a little more of this. I think this time I'm going to go around the shore. I don't think you can even go up there, to be honest with you. Um, so I might just go here and then make my way back uh, through the top there. So this is the other side of that camp that I was at. Look at that. That is so cool. The ship is on its side. Oh, oh you know what? Screenshot moment. Look at that. That is awesome. I'm going to approach with caution um, because I got wrecked last time. There's a, there's a thrall right there. But I'm going to try. I mean, I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it. Oh, that was a stupid hammer. I need to make a two-handed weapon. What are you? Are you going to come at me, bro? What are you? You are a fighter level two. Boom. Uh, boom. Uh, boom. And your head has been crushed. Oh, and I added insult to injury by defeating your dead body or hitting your dead body with another mallet shot what about you you're just walking into the water like are you having a bad day just walking right into the water uh -huh. oh i missed her the first time somehow oh we're doing great guys Do oh oh a nice little roll huh okay easy easy i am crippled that is not good she crippled me what do we have here not interested in any of this stuff okay that boat looks great. I love it. Okay, I'm going to try to make my way around. Maybe get some sweet, sweet loot. If we take it little by little, we should be all right. We should be okay. If we take it one thrall at a time, I've made it to the bridge. There's a guy walking in place over there. I'm sure he's going to be fun to deal with. Come on. Can I lock onto him like this? How close do I have to be? There we go. Uh-huh. You're dead. I said, oh, you gotta be kidding me. I can't get out of that when they start when they, when they start swinging, um, which is unfortunate. I'll take that, I'll take that, I'll take that. I hear, okay, that's just, that's just sails flapping. Ooh, ooh, this is a cool shot. Jamila's Liberty. Jamila's Liberty. Who has spotted me? Who's, this is really, really cool. I love this sideways ship here. Man, they did so as my cutlass was growing rusty. Okay, that's not really. I'm not really scared, to be honest. Taskmaster, I don't need one. I mean, I need one, but I don't. 
need to bring you all the way back. That's going to be annoying. Uh, I'll take your sweet cherries, though, and your purified water. Mmm, delicious. Let's go up here. Let's go up here first. Uh-oh. Is it just you? Is it you that made that sound? Oh, you're a cook! Oh, for some reason, I've decided to put away my, my giant hammer. Okay, easy. I need to heal up after this. Let's keep that in mind. Good, good. Let's take our regenerating potion here. And we will take your candle. <laughs> I'm always looking for uh, decorative items. We'll take your candle and uh, we will uh, leave the rest of everything. Let's see what we got here. Nothing special here. We're still healing up. Let's have a little bit of eggs to regenerate a little bit more. Now let's go a little bit this way. How are, like how? This is a big, this is a big place. You know what else I just remembered? You guys all said, and and, and rightfully so. Ooh, Captain's quarters. You guys all said to um to bring to bring a bedroll with you, and uh, for some reason I I forgot to do that again. Okay, okay. Hold on. You are a carpenter. I'm okay. Easy. Okay, this is where things get bad because I can't move. Okay, there's three of them up there. Uh huh. Suck it, losers. I'm just going to hit you right in the back while you stand there like idiots. Yeah. That's what's happening to you right now. You're getting hit in the back like an idiot. Okay, out of stamina. No problem. Let's have some eggs. Perfect. Uh-huh. I don't know who I'm killing, by the way. Whoever it is, doesn't matter. They're going to respawn here anyway. So if it's somebody important, don't hate me about it. I just want to get up there and see if there's anything special about it. Uh, this guy right here. He's just standing there like a stooge. You know, sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. Out of stamina again. It takes a lot of stamina to fire this bow. He's taking damage because I'm using the poison arrows. <laughs> Sucker! What do we got here? We got a breathing potion and some more iron. Ooh, a cutlet. A falcata. Sh uh, shattered scour scourge stone piece. That's interesting. By the way, I picked up a, um, a longsword from one of the people too. High grade cripple armor. Nut. Ooh, can I? What is this? Is it steel or is it iron? It doesn't matter. What do you have? You have very little. Um, is there anybody else up here? No. This is the captain's court. Ooh, what do we got? Nothing? Nothing? Come on. I came all the way up here to the captain's quarters, and you're going to tell me you've got nothing for me. This is ridiculous. Ah, that's frustrating. Okay, well, them's the breaks, I guess. Let's go down there and clear out the rest of this camp. Another chest here. And nothing. That is a shame. All right, well, we cleared out the entire camp. I think it's time we uh, start heading for home. Like, I'm still going to continue to explore the swamp to see if there's anything uh, anything cool. Um, I would really like to check things out for myself. I know there's, you know, you can, you can go out there and you can search for videos. But what's the fun in that? I want to explore it for myself. Up there is, is where badness lies. <laughs> I don't think I want to go up there. Um, how close are we to leveling? We're still level 39. We killed a lot of people. I'm surprised we, we haven't leveled up yet. But I think I'm going to take the, uh, the shore around and probably just skirt the edge here and come back and see what we can find. Um, yeah. It should be safe enough for us to do that, I hope. Famous last words, perhaps? I made a bedroll. Are you guys proud of me? Uh, building is not allowed here, though. That's not good. I thought maybe I'd be able to place a bedroll here. But it doesn't... Why is everything so bright? My goodness. I can't place a bedroll anywhere here. I think it's because I'm too close to the camp. Um, let me cross the river here. I think those are the world markers. Yes, I still can't place anything. What is going on? It's too, it's too close. Building is not allowed here. Not enough contact with the ground. Oh, here we go. Boom. Previous bedroll was destroyed. All right. I bound myself to this one. I've seen that giant croc over there, and I'm going to take him on. I don't know if this is a terrible idea, but whatever. I've got the bedroll right over there. It's not a big deal. Let's see. First, I should probably heal all the way up. I'm all the way up. Do, 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 do. Where's he at? Oh, he's got a little baby. Hmm. 
something tells me he's gonna be difficult. Ah! Yeah! Yeah! Okay, this is gonna be. This is a losing cause. This is a losing cause. This is like the other one. It's gonna take me forever. It really is. I mean, I could easily just. How long will this take me? My, my weapon will run out of durability before I can actually do any damage to this guy. I think, I, I think, yeah, I think that would probably be what would happen. Oh, and he hurt me a little bit. Okay, you know what? It's fine. We're out of here. Later, idiot. I'm going to bring back some friends and you're going to die. It's a gorilla. I'm a little bit afraid of it. Whoa. Okay, how, how bad is it? It's not too bad. It's got a huge butt. Okay, it doesn't hurt that much. I think I can probably sidestep it a little bit. Oh, careful with the, with the, the staminations. Uh-huh. Just want to see if I can get a gorilla head, honestly. Okay, that hurt a little bit. Woke up in the air and landed on a scorpion. Well, Mazion, that's sometimes that's the life of an exile, you know? Sometimes you're not where you think you are. Okay, that hurt a little bit. Back up, back up, back up. Oh, no, no, don't call your friends. Is that, is that you calling your friends? I hope not. Okay, so, uh, do I just, like, hack them up for a head, possibly? Savory flesh, savory flesh, thick hide, thick hide, bones, thick hide, and savory flesh. Um, okay, well, I don't want any of this because I have eggs, <laughs> and eggs are amazing. That is, I am really, I don't want any of the regular hide either. The thick hide, I guess I'll keep. All right, well, I want to go up here. Man, I'm paranoid. Every time I hear sounds, I turn around. There's another gorilla up here. Um, don't know if this is worth, is that somebody's base? You're already building in the jungle, huh? Well, enjoy the gorillas, you crazy, you crazy person. I'm gonna. This guy's gonna ignore me, I think. He's totally gonna. He's just walking off into the distance. Ooh, this is a cool little uh, root hole. Oh man, there's a lot of gorillas. Um, well, this guy wants some of this. Okay, I tried to kick him in the face. It didn't work. Okay, let's do this. Uh, oh. Go like this, like that, like that, and then like that, and like that, and that, and then we'll follow it up with some of this, and some of that, ooh, and some of this, and some of that. Okay, okay. Now, the knife. Should we use that? Where is it at? The skinning knife. I mean, this is for skin, right? I don't think it gives you the head. Fur. Oh, we got a lot of fur. Let's drop that. Let's drop the thick high. Let's drop 100 of the fur. We have, we're have at 98% encumbrance. I could start wearing the backpack on my head. Uh, but that would sort of like not be fun for me. Oh, oh, I'm supposed to be going this way. There's more gorillas there, though. I don't want to keep fighting gorillas all my life, you know? It's not what, it's not what my mother would have wanted. She's still alive, by the way. <laughs> I'm not sure why I said that. What is this? Plant fiber. A leavening agent. Yep. Seen that before. Uh, ooh, there's a... Is that a bridge? <gasps> is that another thrall camp? That is another thrall camp. I want to go check it out. It doesn't look like it'll be too tough. Come here, you idiot. Oh, you're so lucky. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, lock onto him. Lock onto him. Stop backing up. Stop backing up, you little nice person. Oh, they got pirate legs. Uh, I, I've noticed that actually a lot of them have those uh, those wooden legs. This guy's got a, a bow. Let, let him come to me. Let him come to me. Surprise! Bang and a bang and a bang. Oh, there we go. Taylor's birth. Is that what that was? I gained a level. Sweet. Is he not carrying? Yes, he is. Take those. Take the coal. Taylor's. Oh, there's a couple of you. Okay, okay. Um, you're 
Shouldn't be, shouldn't be a problem. I'm not uh, targeting. Jesus! Uh oh. I can't move! Ah, no, no, no! Stop! What is going on? Holy! Okay, hold on. Where's the bandages? 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 Bandages! I. I couldn't because I had the stupid mallet in my hands. I'm such an idiot. Son of a. Bed roll, bed roll. It's fine. We could get back here in no time. Oh my gosh. I was trying to bandage, guys, but I had the stupid ma maul, the, the hammer in my hand. I was killed by poison. It's not really poison. I think it's like like bleeding. That's all it is. <laughs> that guy's just sliding down the stairs. Dude, what happened to you? I think that was the guy I've already looted, too. They're all dead, if I'm not mistaken. It's just a matter of getting my body here and exploring uh, if there's any... Uh, where's my body at? This is my body right here. This is my body. All right, let's put this on. And this and this. We're at 99% encumbrance. Put that stupid thing on my head. 84% encumbrance. Now we make our way home slowly with this steel warhammer, which I I am not a fan of. Like I said, I am not, uh, not a huge fan of it. By the way, is it just me, or should you not automatically take off your, your weapon and use your bandage when... Um, when you activate it. Like, I feel like that was kind of silly that I have to re physically re actually remove... <sighs> Never mind. Never mind, it's fine. What are we doing here? We need uh, we need our eggs. Where are our eggs at? Eggs are here. We need our water because it gets warm in the jungle. Where's the water? Water's here. And now we uh, look around here a little bit. What do we got? Absolutely nothing. Wait, there's another thing here um nothing absolutely nothing is what we have seriously did these guys at least have something well, we've got some iron i'm gonna drop what weighs the most <laughs> these bones i don't need these bones i don't need this iron stone either uh i don't need any of that i'll take this and i'll take this and i'll take the iron head arrows all right, let's um make. Oh, there's a guy here, or or a lady. She's a lady. She's blocking. She's blocking. Bye. Oh, you're in the ground. <gasps> don't fall. Don't fall. I thought she. Uh, I thought she fell over. Oh, these guys. I remember you. I remember you not being so tough either. I've been poisoned. Okay. Okay, never mind. Never mind. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna bother. Hopefully the poison goes away. Poison has indeed gone away. Good. I'm gonna take the stairs down. I'm just gonna go home. I'm just gonna go home. Little altar here. I don't know what this is. Uh there's there's blue spiders here too, guys, just in case uh, you were wondering. <laughs> what is this? Is that Oh, no, 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 no. Poison, poison spiders and disgusting birds. Oh, there's those blue spiders. Okay, we're going this way. And we're hopefully not getting poisoned. And we're trying to avoid all the terrible things and just get home safe. We just want to be home safe. I'm out of stamina. I should have watched my stamina meter. I know. I drive you guys nuts with that sometimes. I apologize. Oh, there's disgusting cobwebs here. Oh, I don't want to go that. And I hear something horrible. More blue spiders. They shoot their dirty poison at me. Oh, there's cobwebs everywhere. Uh-oh. Crippling poison. This is not good. This is not good. And now the stupid bird. Okay, the crippling poison is worn off. No, bird. Leave me alone, bird. I'm out of stamina. I should have watched that. I'm sorry I didn't. I'm kind of uh, sidetracked with trying to stay alive. Okay. I hate this place. This is beautiful. The beautiful place, but I hate it. Am I even going the right way? I feel like I have entered into an area that I should not be in. Is there... There is a path up there. Oh, got out of, out of the stamina again. I'm really sorry. I think we're okay. <gasps> we're almost out. I've entered the mire of eternal dream. Whoa, there's a cobra! Did you guys see that? A little cobra poisoned me. Jesus! I hate this place. 
Oh, what was that noise? Keep running. Just keep running. I'm poisoned. Oh, it's you. Um, I really don't, I don't want to fight you, but I feel like you're in the way of my way out. Okay. Yes, okay. Yeah. Leopard in your beautiful spots. But I have to kill you. You're going to have a few, a few red spots after this. And you might be dead. Okay, good. I'm not even going to bother taking his, taking his gorgeous skin. Um, I've only got eight eggs left. I keep I keep eating them, even though I'm not hungry, just to regenerate a little bit of life. Ooh, what is this? Why does everything here look so tempting to explore? I'm very worried about this. The eye that never closes. This looks like the temple I found earlier. Is it? It's not the same one though, because I found that one down here. There's more. What is that noise? Oh, does this go out? No, this goes up. We're going. We're going this way. There's another jaguar up there. They're not that bad. Um, to, they're not really difficult to to destroy, <laughs> to murder. So I'm not too worried about it. And there's somebody's base setting up right there. Whew! I feel better. I made it out alive. Um, just barely, but I did it. I did it. And when I say alive, I mean I died a few times. <laughs> but I managed to recover my body and my things. Alright, back home we go. Finally back home. Oh man, it's good to be home. First things first, I need to like, I need to look into some different weapons. But before that, ooh. Ooh, before that even happens, I'm going to turn some of this iron into steel because I want to switch to all steel stuff. No more iron tools. I have a steel pickaxe now that I need to repair, uh, but I can't repair it right now. Can I? Info? No. I think I need to research it first, possibly. Um, but let's go ahead and put some... Uh, oh, this goes in here. There we go. Like this, like this. And did I not get wood? I thought I had some wood to, to, to turn it into things, but I guess not. Uh, we got some more steel fire going here. We don't have a whole lot of steel fire, to be honest with you. I got to make maybe make make some necessary runs here. I don't think this has anything, and that really doesn't have anything important. Okay, how bad is this pickaxe? It's pretty bad. Let's take this out of here. Can we not create a pickaxe yet? I bet. I bet. Oh, nope. I bet. Pick. Pick. Pickaxe. Oh, requires level 43 still. Dang. Okay, so we still can't even... I'm still going to carry it around. Oh, one thing I wanted to test out. The Frost Whore. Or the Whore Frost. Have they repaired it? Give me a tree. And tell me that it's so. Please. Please. I need some of this. I need these ice shards back. I mean, the trees aren't disappearing after one hit anymore. But I'm still not getting ice shards out of these trees. What the heck? Dude. What is your problem, man? Ah! Rude. Let's try this again. I don't think I don't think these frost shards. That just goes after that just gets sticks. Uh branches from that tree. Ah, do I need to go up north to get these frost shards or what is happening here? I thought this was a glitch and it was going to get fixed before launch. But maybe maybe it's specific trees. I don't seem to be getting anything from these trees. Let's see if the theories are true. <gasps> yes, you get them from bodies now. Finally. Finally. Okay, okay, okay. You know, I just wanted some frost shards from your buddy's body. But now you're going to provide me with some more. And you too. Yeah. We need we need a steel longsword, guys. I'm crippled. I'm crippled. That tells you. Okay. Take. I said take. Okay. Ice shards. I wish you could like not take the human flesh. Ice shards. Don't want. Don't want. I have 21 ice shards. Things are looking up. Remember the archer I caught not too long ago? Well, he now has a permanent place. There you go, buddy. Hurricanian Archer number two. 
Uh, move, follow, cancel, inf open inventory. We could probably put some armor on him later and stuff. Speaking of armor, let's let's figure out what we're doing here, okay? First of all, let's start with the weapons before the armor. These are one-handed swords. I, I really want to do two-handed swords. This The steel, ah, the mace. Okay, the bruiser. A uh, two-handed star metal sword. I need a haft maker, and for that I need star metal tools, and for that I need hardened steel, steel tools, which I am not able to make yet because I'm not level 50. Um, so that sucks. <laughs> um, uh, okay. Let's check out the more regular weapons. Okay, so we've got the... Mm, maybe a pike might be good to try out. A steel spear. Health damage 29. Here's the thing. The steel warhammer does 30 damage. So out of all... Ooh. A steel two-handed sword. I can make that already. That's good. It does 33 damage. Okay. An iron two-handed sword does 26. We're going to make a steel uh, sword, I think, is what we're going to do. And we're going we're gonna to go test it out on that village where I can get all these ice shards. Um, but wait. There's more. I also want to check out... Ooh, 40 steel bars. Very nice. I also want to check out what armors I have available. Uh, we have Nordheimer armors. Ooh, this will be good for the cold. I like it. Exile epics. We got raider armor. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Zamorian thief. Wow. Okay. Oh, the decorative war paints are cool, but I can't do the one, uh, the functional war paints yet. I could just do the decorative ones. This will be a good one. Armor smith. Okay, we just researched that. We can't really do any of these yet. We can do the Nordheimer armors, which I think is a good idea. Yeah, we can't do any of these. They all require exile epics, which is only available at level 60. Oh my gosh. Okay. All right, we're doing pretty good. What else do we have available to us? We have 16 points. I uh, don't think I want any of this stuff. The trebuchet might be a good thing to grab, but we'll wait on that. I'm not really interested in that. The sandstorm mask. The Shemite or Shemite stuff. Ooh, the Journeyman Tinkerer. A patch kit for repairing damaged armor. A tool kit for repairing damaged weapons. Let's research that one. Then there's the Weaponsmith. Uh, bag of unpleasant things. Okay, we'll research that one. The cages. Oh, yes, the cages. It's only a one cost of one, too, so I'll take that. The razor arrows. Health damage, 10. And then we got the tinkerer. Or tinker. I'll do that one, too. Gotta make sure these weapons are on point. These stairs are cool, but I don't think I have the materials for that anyway. The fireplace is cool. The steel throwing axe. Okay. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna cool it with that just now. Where is the steel? Two-handed steel sword. Here we go. I'm excited about this. The armor. Where's the armorer's bench? What can I create here? I guess I can create the heavy stuff, but. Whoa, that looks awesome! The Cambogian Shaman chest piece. A chest piece worn by the Shamans of Cambogia. That looks really cool. Medium boot lining. It's going to be medium armor. Now, people were saying that uh, since my, my armor is heavy armor, so of course the, um, the reptile armor was weaker, but it also allows you to move quicker. I kind of just want to, like, go all out this season, though. Like, I want to be, like, a tank. I really want to tank it. I don't want to worry about moving quick and dodging and stuff. Although, I'll probably have to worry about that for, like, PvP-ish situations. But for now, I want to just tank it. I'll, I will try all those different armors, though. Why not? If I have the, the materials to make them, I'm going to try them all out and see which ones I like the best. First and foremost, though, let's go test. Wow, this thing is huge! Oh, oh that's cool. Man, that took a lot of stamina, though. I hope that's not a sign of things to come. Okay, here we go. This is gonna be a long. This is gonna be a big camp. Lots of people. Lots of people. Hi. Oh, I like this sword, guys. I like this sword. Okay. Uh, I kind of wanted to collect. Okay, let's collect these real quick. Yoink. Yoink! Back we go. It's got oh level three archer. Oh, how did I miss that? How did I... I'm not hitting her at any? Oh come on, game! Come on, game! Seriously, game! You gotta be kidding me! 
Okay, this guy took up. He, I two shot at him. That's good. This guy's running at me with the bow. Oh, I love this sword. Let's see if I can hit her this time. Okay, I can. Gangster. I really like this sword. Coming back with a nice, nice amount of uh, of human flesh, apparently. But also a nice amount of shards. 91 shards. I found, uh, like, a ton of tools over there, too. That was pretty awesome. That archer, by the way, I know it probably can't shoot over those barriers. But I don't uh, think I can make the, um, the, oh, what are they called? The crenellations? I don't think I can make those yet. And even if I can, I'm not really interested in making those yet. What I really want to do is upgrade this thing. What do I got here? A hundred ice shards, and I have them. Fantastic. I need 30 manifestations of zeal, which means I need to make some ice shard arrows. Let's go get some feathers. Another thing, too, is um, I, need a, I need a bed. I need a bed, right, guys? Of course. It's crafting right now. I promise you. There it is. Uh, let's put it. Why is this bowl here? Let's pick up this dang bowl, and let's put the bed right uh, there. Can we put it right there? There we go. Why can't I put it there? There we go. Boom. Bound to finish B. That's me. <laughs> um, okay. Good. Now we've got that. Now, how's this going? I made a bunch of frost tipped arrow or frost frost arrows. Not frost tipped. We've got 12 manifestations of zeal. We need 30. So I now have 110 of those. I have a lot of feathers. I need more ice shards. More ice shards are necessary. Um, I guess I'm going back. I'm going back to a, a, a village, a camp, and I'm going to go wreck some more faces. The time have, has finally come, you giant ugly turtle. You will no longer terrorize me. I am no longer afraid of you. I will defeat you with my two-handed sword. He missed me. You suck, idiot. <laughs> I like how I insult them as I'm taking their lives. Oh, I'm out of stamina. Okay. Okay. No longer calling him an idiot. I'm the idiot now. Dead. You are dead. How do I get his head? Chitin? Is it Kai? Exotic flesh? Exotic flesh? Okay. I didn't get ahead of a boss creature. Anyway, I'm out here. Um, we out here. I'm out here getting some uh, iron because I need some iron. I don't have a whole lot. And uh, I know there's some right here. This is where we're at. No, I don't need that for iron. I need this. Perfect. Um, I'm in the process of getting these ice shards. Whoa. Whoa! Holy crap! That scared the crap out of me. Jesus! Dude! Don't do that! Huh. I will take your stupid ice shards out of your body, though. As I was saying, I'm trying to upgrade my shrine. Uh, but I need a whole lot of ice shards because I have to create arrows to get those manifestations of zeal and each arrow set takes 10 ice shards <sighs> yeah so it's uh it's, it's gonna take a while but we can handle this i don't want this and i don't want this and i think that's about it for my inventory dang it all right buddy follow me i've got an idea that none of you came up with none none nobody at all i didn't i didn't hear this in my last video multiple times at all. I need him to get out of the middle here. It sucks that you can't pick them up again. Is he going to follow me up the stairs? Alright, right there is good. Right there is good. Now, stay. Stop following. Okay, good stuff. So, a, a bunch of you mentioned in the last episode to put four blacksmiths side by side by side um, in the middle of this thing. And I think that's a great idea. So that's what I'm going to do right now. Hopefully they all place properly. So let's try to keep it sort of straight. This, this part always worries me. Each one of these is 100 iron, by the way. I had to grind for iron just now just to get these guys ready to go. Let's try... Uh, there. We did it. We did it. Now we're going we're gonna to flip it around. Okay. Gonna flip it around. Oh, this guy's still following me. I told you to stop following me, dude. What is your problem? I said stop following. Okay, well, follow me again then. Ugh. Can't trust a guy in... In reptilian armor. Come on, man. I don't got all day. Now, you stay here. Okay. Do you understand what that means? 
Okay, you understand what that means, right? Good. All right, so I got two. Now let's try for this one, which we should be able to place here. Ooh, can I? Is it easier to place like this? Oh, yes, it is. Yes, it is. Ooh, look at this. Boom. Ho, 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 ho. Okay. Now go around like this. Uh, one seems higher than the other. That's okay. It's fine. It doesn't, it doesn't bother me at all. Does it bother you guys? No, it doesn't. It doesn't bother you guys at all. I might have to... What can I... I can't really lower it. I could lower it, but it, it'll look kind of... Hmm. Hmm. Okay, hold on. I think if we just do this, it'll be okay. A little bit more to the side here. Oh, this is so... There we go. That's not bad. That's not bad. And now the final one, we're actually still waiting for a, a few more of these because it takes 50 of these. There we go. Perfect. Now let's make the last one. And we'll put the other one here. And then this will actually... So now it does make sense to have the room surrounded by furnaces and have the blacksmith's bench in the middle. We might even have room for some of these here and there. Um, but I think that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to have to move those, those tables out. And by move, I mean destroy them. This one kind of sucks. I really wish you could pick these up. It's okay. Maybe we'll fix it one day, but it doesn't really matter right now. Um, I kind of just need to see the edges here. Uh, no, a little bit further, like so. And that should do it. That should be fine. Yeah, one of them's a little off, but that's okay. This is kind of cool, though. We have a four-way forge here in the middle. Now let's go check on our upgrade process here the um oh careful the shrine upgrade what do we got we got 60 ice shards we need 100 we've got the 30 manifestations of zeal 24 shaped wood 350 brick okay i gotta i got three <laughs> i gotta get my brick on and i need a bunch more ice shards too i need 40 more ice shards oh i'm tired of going up and down that hill i think it's time for a vertical elevator let's do that let's cancel those because we need 28 of those i was i was making all kinds of these because we need 28 to upgrade the the shrine but anyway we can do this first and then we can make this happen we could probably do it now yes we can okay good stuff so this vertical elevator is going to help me i don't know exactly where to place it probably over here somewhere maybe even here actually uh but it's going to help me climb up and down now i know it's kind of slow but it's better than me wasting all kinds of stamina just trying to climb up and down and up and down that hill constantly. I think I'm going to put it up top here. Oh, I don't remember if it has to be placed like on a foundation or if it could just be placed wherever. We can actually test that right now. Unable to find a valid end location. So if we put it like right here, that'd be good. And then we could have, well, we could put it here as well or in between these two. Ooh, what about like this little bit right here oh this is kind of annoying it's kind of annoying to climb up i guess we could put some stairs down though okay i think that's what i'll do what i have to do first however is uh is get some um some of these guys foundations oh i, oh, I do have foundations sweet let's put that down i think that's all we'll probably need is the two and then we'll work out stairs and stuff Afterwards, I don't know if I like that. I don't. It's okay. We'll we'll be fine. Let's put it like. Well, let's put it uh, right here. Can we not? Space is currently occupied. Hey, like right there. Okay, good. <laughs> okay, good. Boom. There's our vertical elevator. Oh, this is gonna save me. Son of a. Gah. Back up we go. How is this going to look? Probably terrible. Oh, I can't actually connect it to this. Well, crap. However, I think I could probably connect the ceiling. No? And then hopefully the ceiling I can use to, to walk over. Okay, good. I know it's going to look terrible, but my idea is that I'm eventually going to have a tower down here with just the elevator inside. And I think that'll be kind of cool. All right, now we got it. Now we got it. It should go all the way down. Ah! 
that's pretty good. I'm going to put uh, foundations under here anyway eventually when I have the tower. So it's not a big deal. The good thing about these is you can move them around anywhere you want. Oh, yeah. That's, that's fine. That'll work fine. That'll work fine. That's going to save me so much time. Okay. What do we got going on here? We've got uh, 24 of these and 350 bricks. Man, the 350 brick is not going to be fun to wait for. I should probably make a bunch of furnaces. Okay, let's just move the, the, the basic. Oh, no. I wanted to move. Ah. Shift. 24. Okay. Good. Do I have enough to make more furnaces? If I do, I think I'm going to start my uh, furnace making process. All right, 350 brick. Now it's time to take the elevator. Yay. Oh, this is going to save me so much time. Here we go, getting this room organized. I've got the four furnaces going. I've removed the other furnaces. What I'll do is I'll put two side by side anywhere I can fit them near a window. The windows will have the fireball cauldrons, I think, if we have enough room. If not, we'll find room for them. So here there will be a fireball cauldron. Then here there will probably be one, then two, or maybe even three here I could probably fit. Actually, let me see. These are, it's really hard. I kind of put the windows in a random place, and that's, it's kind of messing with my build. So, if anything, I can remove some windows. Anyway, how are we doing in terms of bricks? We have 127. We have 133. We have 139. We have 145 bricks. I'm not sure if that's enough, but we're about to find out. Let's take the elevator down, shall we? Because why not? Oh, I really need some stairs for here. I really need some stairs. Um, the good thing about this is I can start the tower from the bottom down. Like, I can put the, the things and then walls all the way down so I know it's going to be even with the elevator right in the middle. That's that's the only part that I was concerned about. So we should be all right. Actually, come to think of it, the elevator is a square. I'm going to have to put a square here. I will figure it out later. Not a big deal. Okay. Oh, we're going this way. Now, I had 200 and... Oh, we are so close. We're so oh, we, we have it. Oh, 360. Never mind. I didn't see that. Okay, here we go. It's upgrading. Upgraded. Upgrade to Blooded Altar. Now, I don't know exactly what this will do for us in the immediate future, but long term, obviously, we need to upgrade this to get our, our god, our, 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 ye how do you pronounce it? Yamir? Yamir? Yamir. It's probably Yamir. Yeah, our Yamir god. Um, I have a few more stones here. Let me go put those in the thingamajigger furnaces and then we'll check back with the altar if i remember correctly it changes automatically but i am am i remembering correctly i probably i'm probably remembering incorrectly we've got to find one of these priests that should be our mission for the next episode find one of the priests what do we got going on here oh it's almost done okay okay let's stand back and watch it it shouldn't be long now Come to think of it, I probably shouldn't have I probably shouldn't have upgraded it down here because I kind of wanted to make its own little thing. Boom! There it is. It's all the more lovely than I thought. Oh yeah, I remember Winter's Majesty. Cool. Cool. And there's the Horfrost hatchet. Ice. That's the same as before. Lots more inventory space now. Winter's Majesty, huh? Light. These are this is light armor. I bet I'll look pretty swanky in it. But for now, I'm not concerned with it. Guys, that's going to be it for this episode. Oh, we got a whole lot done. We got a whole lot done. It might not seem like it, but man, that was a lot of grindy work to get to where we were. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Thumbs up for the right pronunciation of Yamir. 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 Bye-bye.